Moldova plans to fully withdraw from Moscow-led bloc by 2024. Here's a summary of the article. Moldova plans to withdraw from all agreements, totaling around 330 signed within the Commonwealth of Independent States by the end of 2024. Doina German, a Moldovan lawmaker from the Action and Solidarity Party, said in a TV interview that Moldova is in its final stage of withdrawal, although it might not be marked with a formal declaration. Moldova's withdrawal from the Russian-led bloc, of which it has been a member since its independence in 1991, would be a significant step for Moldova in severing its ties to Russia. Moldova, a former Soviet state bordering with southern Ukraine, has taken an increasingly pro-Western stance since Russia's full-scale invasion. The existence of the separatist Russian enclave of Transnistria inside its territory, which continues to threaten its sovereignty, has played a large part in Moldova's distrust of Moscow. Moldova's plans to withdraw from the organization started in March 2022, after it applied to join the EU. Moldova will be excluded from the bloc's interparliamentary assembly, its legislative body, in February 2024, for which the country paid approximately $332,600 in annual membership fees. On December 14, Russian President Vladimir Putin described Moldova's presence in the CIS as not of great value, even taunting Moldova by saying that it will likely suffer without the Russian market and gas supplies, Russian state media TASS reported. This post received a score of 6,000, with an upvote ratio of 97%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. No one wants to be part of Russia's fake empire. Except for our fat fuck Orban. God I am ashamed of him. The equivalent of a Belgian missing the Nazi boot stepping on his throat. Plenty of them existed. My great-grandparents were resistance fighters murdered by Belgian sympathizers after the liberation. By the end of 2024. Clarifying for anyone like me who saw the headline and thought that Moldova will withdraw in the next nine days. I was about to say they better get moving haha. We've time to hit that old dusty trail. Putin has utterly destroyed Russia. It's glorious. He just needs to die now and it should get better. No. He fucked it for a long time. I think they mean like Hitler. One to the head and he will forever be known as the guy that killed Putin. Statues might even be built. Screw Russia. I see a pattern. Russia ACTS mean? Other countries distance themselves from Russia? Rinse and repeat. The opposite would happen if Russia was nicer. After regime changes and a lot of groveling, maybe. Nah. After regime change Russians will pretend again that they've changed, trust me bro, for real this time, and attack someone again in 20 to 30 years. Greater than 20 to 30 years. There is no optimism on the menu. How long until Putin announces plans to the Nazify Moldova? Original Ukraine invasion plans which Lukashenko showed live on TV included invading Moldova after Ukraine. Link? Link. Cells of Russian ethnics will revolt in 3, 2, 1. They already have Transnistria in place there. We have one Transnistria, yes. What about second Transnistria? Donetsk? Luhanksis? Throws apple. Godspeed. I can't wait to spend my vacation dollars in Moldova. F. Putin. They make excellent wine. Worth a try if you can find some. The wine is incredible. The craft beer scene has really taken off too. The food has always been great. People need to stop rewriting history just because a person, country, dog does something they like. Moldova hasn't ever had good food and likely never will. Them distancing from Russia is great. That doesn't mean they magically became the best country on the planet with the best culture, food, people, wine, nature, movies overnight. People weren't vacationing in Moldova before and they aren't going to after because, by and large, the place is still a corrupt shithole. Sincerely, a Moldovan. When is Hungary withdrawal from the bloc? When they eject Orban. Russia complaining about Western imperialism, manipulating Moldova into leaving their brotherhood in 3, 2, 1. Russia has been an abusive partner in basically every bilateral and Soviet-era relationship they had with other countries that were part of the USSR or the Eastern Bloc. 
When the Soviet Union collapsed, basically every former member immediately aligned themselves with the US and distanced themselves from Russia. If Russia were sane they'd have engaged in some serious reflection about what it was about the nature of their country and its leadership that caused countries to switch sides so quickly. Fast forward to the invasion of Ukraine, and Russia is losing partners faster than at any point since the end of the Cold War. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.